Hey scientists, today we're going to talk about how to cite evidence from a text for our CER and do a CER for this cell project. Okay, so I have a cell model newspaper. So I have the picture of the model, I have a title, I have an introduction. It very much looks like kind of a newspaper or magazine. I used a template for this. Um, and I have all the cell parts and their definition. So really what I need to get down to is the CER. Now, I've actually called it CER here for now, but I am going to want to change that to make it more interesting because it's way more interesting than the words or the letters CER. But I find it hard to change the title until after I've written. So I'm going to write first and then change the title later. I also just copied and pasted the language from the rubric here because it is pretty helpful. And I'm in, I have the formatting all set up down here. So I'm actually just going to kind of let this be a rough draft and I'm going to delete things when I'm done. Okay, so I know that we have to prove that organelles work together in a cell. So in a cell, all the organelles work together to make the cell, I'm going to use the word function. Okay, claim. Cool. So basically I just took this and restated it in a way to make it a statement. This claim can be proven. I'm already on a good path. Okay, now I need text evidence. Now. Evidence in science can come from a video, it can come from a simulation, it can come from a textbook, but it also can come from an article. And so I'm gonna actually go ahead and I picked out an article. If you notice, there's a whole section for this CER that talks about how the organelles work together. So this one's about plant cells, this one's about just animal cells, this one's about plant and animal cells, both. And that's the one that I went ahead and I read and I took notes on already. So I actually put a little star by it so I would know that I wanna come back to it. And so I'm actually going to go ahead and go right down to this section that I liked that has my quote. All right. So I'm going to pull this right here. Um, uh, I think I'm just going to take this paragraph. Okay. So I'm going to copy and paste this paragraph over. I'm going to change my formatting so it matches. Sorry, two seconds. It's got to match. It bothers me when it doesn't. Some people it doesn't bother. It bothers me. Okay. And because these aren't my words, I need to give credit. So I'm going to write according to, and I'm going to write plant cells and, oops, cells and animal cells best biffles for life. Yes, I just said biffles. Um, and I'm going to put a comma. Now, this is a title. You can underline it. You can bold it. You can italicize it. You can link it. I like the italics. I also like the link. And because these aren't my words, I have to put them in quotation marks. So there we go. So I got my evidence. Oops. <laughs> there we go. I've got my evidence in quotation marks. So if we actually split this apart, right, this is my claim. This is my evidence. Now I need to add some reasoning. Okay, now let's see, uh, ooh, let's change the color so we can write, this is, this is part of the process of cellular respiration, which I just spelled wrong, hmm. okay, cellular respiration, mm -mm. no, the mitochondria and the cytoplasm during, I like that better, during cellular respiration to make sure the cell has energy without this process, the cell could not survive. All. Do I want a concluding sentence? No, I kind of like it stopping there. Okay. So, I see how I highlighted? I have claim, I have evidence in the middle, and I have the reasoning, but I'm actually going to take all that away 
because we don't need it now that I have it written. In a cell, all the organelles work together to make the cell function. According to plant cells and animal cells, best friends for life, glucose molecules are broken down in the cytoplasm. Those smaller molecules then head to the mitochondria to be converted into something the cell can use. The mitochondria takes the small food molecules, combines them with oxygen to make an energy called ATP. And then my reasoning, this is part of the process of cellular respiration. The mitochondria and the cytoplasm work together during cellular respiration to make sure the cell has energy. Without this process, the cell could not survive. Granted, I'm an adult, these are adult words. You are in sixth grade, you should be using sixth grade words, right? But this is my version of my reasoning. Okay, so cool. Now I've got this, I've got everything there. I'm actually gonna delete this. And I'm gonna change my title up here. Um, organelles working together. Yeah, there we go. This is kind of part of the claim, right? Organelles working together. I like that. All right, now I have one more thing to do because I did quote this text evidence, especially because I wrote it in here. And again, you can link it. Um, but the other thing I like to do is just go to the cell model resources. And I can actually copy the link here, or I can copy this. And I want to make sure on my sources I have, okay, I have space for it already. Um, I have that all set up and ready to go. Um, all right, there is my CER. I made sure I put my evidence um, quote down on my sources along with all the other things I learned from. And that's it. That's my CER using text evidence for a cell model. Good luck, scientists.